Hi there, everybody. We're back with the Business Spotlight, and I'm really delighted to introduce you to John Maxwell, of uh, Managing Director of Inverallan Ground Maintenance. And uh, John's going to give us a sneak preview into his business, his business experience, and how he works in the Stirling and Forth Valley community, um, and what he's um, aiming to do with his business. So, John, for our viewers, who are you? What do you do? How long have you been doing it? And just just introduce yourself, please. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm John Maxwell, um, Managing Director of Inver Island Grounds Maintenance Limited. Um, the business started back in 1998 um, when I was had another full-time job um, in, in retail and um, it only took a year for, for me sort of doing the, the two jobs that I realised that I wanted to do the, 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 the you know, the job full time. And so 1999, after doing a, um, a business course, we, we, we started the, the company in October 99 and been here ever since. And the company's just grown. It just keeps growing and, and growing now. Um, we've got, um, we've got up to 14 employees in the, the summer and now we're about nine, nine bands now. We've got our vehicles all in the, the company all together now. So, um, and we're just in the process of now just buying our own land. We've bought our own land now, so we're going to have our own um, our own yard, our own base, because um, we've been at Manor Farm for twelve years down here now. So, um, so twenty twenty three is going to be a, a a good exciting year for us. And my, my son came into the business last year as well. So he's um, my son Ronald. He's now a director of the company. So. It sees the next part of the 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 the, the hopefully the success story in, in taking the business forward, and your succession plan by the sides of it as well. So, what yeah. would you say makes the business stand out? Makes you different from your competition? You know, what's your unique selling? Well, I'm very much hands on. I've always I've always been out alone. <laughs> There's a lot of time I could be in the constantly in the office, but um, we're very proactive. And if there's any issues, there's any problems, there's any mishaps, we get it done straight away. Um, I've built the business on its really its core values and, and doing things. And we, we, we keep it local, very much local. We, we don't ex really, we've only just recently started to go out and, and out with our area, started to go into Fife and then to West Lothian. But primarily we are at Manishire, Stirling and Falkirk. That is our main core of our business, and you know, and it's worked very well for us. You know, from we do all the work for all the leading property management companies in Scotland, and and the commercial side as well. Um, and we've built the business up. We've got a good, very good reputation um, for reliability and, and getting the job done. Which, you know, in this day and age, when everything's done to a cost, we're still very competitive in our costs compared to the, the the larger, the bigger boys in the in, in the in the industry. So in that way, yeah. So we've we're, we're done well, and hopefully we can just keep that going. And you know, with the, the, it's very much a family business that, that we have as well. My wife's involved in the company as well. So it's um, yeah, the, the the three of us, yeah, they are, are very. We've got it very well, yeah. And and what's your business journey been like? You 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 kind of you said a family business, so um you know you've started you know almost well a long time ago. How what what's been your key learning? What's your you know has it been easy? Has it been ups and downs to get? Oh, to it's business? a roller coaster. It's <laughs> been a roller it's certainly much a roller coaster. But I mean it's it's, it's like it's like a life journey. It's it can be a, it's, it's very much the ups and downs, and there's there's been good times and bad times. Um, but I mean, it's 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 been it, it, it's it, it's been hard. There has been hard times, but but very much sort of good and positives, and you know that that's the that that's the 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 thing. And we're very fortunate. All the help that we've had as well um, in our, in, in the journey that we've had. Um, but yeah, yeah, it's it's good, and obviously there's there's going to be more. There's there's going to be more ups and downs, but that, that's that's just life. So I've enjoyed. I've enjoyed it so far. Yeah, yeah, it's been good. So looking ahead to what you're aiming to achieve with the ground maintenance, mm -hmm. what what is that? What is that? What's the what's the aspiration? What do you see the main challenges in getting there? Fairly big growth plans. So what are your unforeseen challenges potentially? Um, 
Oh God, that's a, the spotlight of well, what to what to sort of to say. Uh, oh God, um, I, I, I don't know. I mean, very much. We, we, we have a, we've got a plan of what we're, we're wanting to do, and as I said, that this year we've rebranded. We've got the vehicles. Well, there's 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 certainly new vehicles that's came into the fleet now. Um, there's new vans. We're changing over the vans. We've got the new branding. Um, which has been very positive feedback we've had. We've always had our vehicles, I've always had our company logo, but now having all the vehicles wrapped within the, the, the corporate, it gives us very much a corporate identity and all everything's all the, 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 the same. And now going to be obviously building, going to be starting building our own yard, our own premises, having our, our own unit as opposed to renting. So that's going to be this year is going to be a very exciting year for the the business, and we're 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 growing, be it slowly, but I mean it's 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 a good growth that we're we're doing year on year. We we keep acquiring new new developments and, and new business, and generally in in, in still we have a, a lot of the business parks that we maintain both during the summer and in our winter maintenance for our snow clearing and gritting. And that just keeps growing as well. We've added another gritter, we've added another slope out onto the fleet as well. So it's given us a good growth potential sort of there, but we just need the winter weather, which which we don't have just now. <laughs> you know, so but, but that that's the challenges we have. You know, you, right. you, you have to invest. And and you know, and, and there's some years we, we you might not get any snow or or or, or you know, or very little. Um, and it's the same as as, as frosty weather, um, so you have to sort of go with that. That's the that that's the thing. But for the the, the business is sort of growing the way I, I like. It's not we're not fast, you know. It's not. I would like it to be a wee bit more faster, but I think it's a, it's a, a nice growth and it's a steady growth and it's a sustainable growth, which is the main thing. That's the the the, the thing. And as I said, my, with my son coming into the business. It's given it a, 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 a bit of a, a good bit of fresh air and a bit of enthusiasm and, and, and things like that into the company. So it's that I can take the, the positives from that. How do you manage that family dynamic? You've got your wife, your your son. How, you know, well, there's a quite a lot of family businesses in in, in Scotland. You know, and, and it's I was speaking to um uh, family business Renella hairdressing and it was really interesting to hear them talk about it. Tell us a bit about you know how you, how you manage it as a family. Do you do you have rules or do you just just are you very easy about it? No, we we there's no there's no rules. I mean, the, there's there's like any sort of family and and, and any business arrangement. There's the there's the um, that they can be the the the, the conflict of you know that. They don't agree or, or, on everything and want to do something, but I think in, in, in general we we we're sort of fine, you know. We're we're we we obviously my son who's he's he's just he's, he's just um, turned twenty, right. and he's he's very good ideas. So it, and and there's 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 quite a few a, a lot of his ideas have, have turned into reality. So it, 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 it's, it's, it's so. I take the positives from that as well. It's maybe something that I wouldn't have, have, have maybe done, but we've just went on that. Um, and, and my wife, who has, has been with me, obviously, throughout this full journey, um, she's more in, in the house because my wife has multiple sclerosis. So she's in a wheelchair. Right. Um, so she does all the telephone and, and all that sort of the back admin of the, the, the company. Um, and, and and does that so yeah so it's it's a good but we don't take it home but once we finish work that's it. It, but we talk about where we're going to go and what we're going to do so and, and that aspect is yeah it's good good and then um, what has been your biggest learning or your biggest lesson in business today oh, wow um I, I don't know it's hard to sort of say I mean Sometimes you've just got to take the risks, really. You know, I don't know. It's it's a hard one to sort of. I, I would say to to to, to basic science. Um, I think sometimes you, you you've got to sort of take take a risk. I think you know it's it, it's hard. It's and initially when I first started. Um, 
you're worrying about where's where's the next job coming from because it's your money you've got bills to pay and, and things like that um and even just now it's you know we're um, we're probably just in just just about half a million turnover just now um but even still you I'm still I'm not as much but I'm still then I still want the the, the, the work I'm still enthusiastic I still want to, to 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 basically get more more work and 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 grow the business more and I don't like to lose contracts and thankfully we've we've lost very little over the the, the years um but it's always sort of good to keep growing and I like that it's, it's that 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 thrill and excitement of, of winning a new contract and getting a new client and keeping on board and growing it that way. And the latest thing is that the Stirling University the Innovation Park, we've just now basically got every client up there now is that they had one company that was out with, that had outsourced another company that now have come on board with us now. So it's great. So I've got everything all tied up you know it there so it, it's a case of just then growing that way I, that that that's what gives me the excitement and the, and the, and, the, and the passion of, of doing this job what i'm doing i, I love it you had one that was just not it was just you well, know, I, had, I had one that was it was so was it persistence was it persistence that got no, you there? They, 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 no because they've seen us and they've, they've done the work and the their their um the the their contract they're letting them down so it gives us the opportunity to, to 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 go in there, and then we've just started that 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 contract co- co- past two weeks. So it, it's good to sort of just go in there and just make a, a difference straight away. Um, but tie with not within one area, as I said, we very much. I'm very passionate about just having their work local. I I I don't really see the point of travelling 40, 50 miles away into Glasgow or Edinburgh or Dundee to do. The maintenance work when everything's all on our doorstep that's the that that's the the the, the thing that we, we very much do everything within within the, the you know the, the fourth valley so, so it's yeah. local so it sounds like you're saying locality quality you know being really strong on giving that client service and that's that's paid dividends by having yeah. it tied up in that way yeah yeah brilliant i love it so um, if you could go back to Mr. John Wa- Maxwell at 18, or maybe you're, you're giving this advice to Ranald, um, what, what is the best piece of advice you could give yourself now if you think back? Um, yeah, I mean, of course, there's, there's things that potentially maybe have, have, have changed or done differently. Um, but I, I, I don't know. I, you know, probably you know, be maybe truthful. Probably not changed a lot to be, to, you know, to, uh, you know, yeah. I would say there's probably a little wee bits and bobs, no major changes. You know, I mean, it's it's been a journey, and it's been a, a fantastic journey, as I said, highs and lows. But I, I would say that there's not a lot I would change. Possibly the main thing I would probably say, I wish I would bought my business premises years ago as opposed okay. to now and that's only because of the financial climate and you have to pay more money but i should have done that i, sh- I should have bought I-, I should have you know so we invested out, in business, the business and get the vehicles and all the machinery as well as you know buying land and then building and things like that so but that would have been that my, my thing i should have done i should have done that years ago you know yeah, for well, sure. that's, what I'm getting, that's what i'm getting told by my son i should have done this years ago you oh, know that's, that's nice to hear the words of wisdom from a 20 year old <laughs> <laughs> but yeah i suppose property in 98 was definitely cheaper than it is today that's that's definitely. But prop- property today is definitely cheaper uh, today than it is in the future. So <laughs> well, that's it. I had to, to, to do it. You know, I had to do it sometime, and we were about growing our premises down, down at, at Manor Farm Business Park. So it was just an inevitable step to, to to basically then just go and get land, then just build on. So that that's the that's a good thing for twenty twenty three. You know, so we're we're growing the business. We've 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 got another vehicle that's on order. So it should be here in April. 
So that will then give us up to nine vehicles all, all in, you know. So it, it's it, it's good that way. And, the, the, yeah, so it, it's good then with the new premises. So, yeah, 2023 is going to be, a, a, a you know, a, yeah, hopefully. You, you, I love your positivity, John. You're like, 2023 is going to be amazing. It's I going to be a good year. What inspires you? What, what what makes that passion and that positivity? My twenty year old son. That's a... <laughs> no, no, no. I mean, it's it's a case of the you know we're growing the business. And obviously, Ronald Den's going to take over. Um, I mean, I'm fifty seven now, so um, you know, I'm hoping to 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 retire. You know, and and, and probably within the next ten years. You know, I'll, I'll but even less. I'm going to be taking up more of a back seat. Ronald's going to be taking over. Once he learns more about the 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 the, the business, um, and and do that, and then then take over, then he can then take it to the next level. That's the that that's the the, the main thing. So it's it's getting more building more of a foundations for him then to take on. Then then obviously when he has his family, you know, then then he can then hopefully pass that down. That was the that's the that that's the well hopefully that would be the that would be the nice idea for for everyone to happen, you know. But yeah. we're just well, building the we're just building the the main foundations just now we've, we've got a good established you know company it's just the premises now and just then that'll just give us you know that, that'll give us a, a good a really good um, foundation fantastic so how can people find Inveral and um, maintenance ground maintenance services where where would they get in touch if they think oh that John's business he's the one for me I need to change my contractor how do they mm -hmm. get in touch? Yeah, yeah. Look, the, the, the website is, is Inveralin, gm .co .uk. Okay. Yeah, or or they can go just Google Inveralin landscapes. We come up because we've been longest that since I first started. Even when I was nineteen ninety eight, doing the 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 full my full time job, and I'd done this part time. We had a website then back in nineteen ninety eight. So when I was only doing it part time, I had a website established then. Um, so I, we've been on the web since 1998. So that's the the, the thing. So we're, we're we don't pay for for Google ratings, but we're 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 on the first page. You know, even if someone Google's commercial grounds maintenance, we'll come up, we'll come up. So it's that way. So they got the website, which we just had revamped last year. Inverallen GM .uk, They can find us on Twitter, Instagram. So we do. The main ones and and that says or give us a phone give us a phone as well you know Brilliant. that's it 